Time for a midweek break cocktail style. Jamie Jackson along with us. I don't want to say your reputation precedes you, <laughs> but Joe Winters never gets here this early. and He's walking the halls already this you know, morning. Yeah, just so you know, we had a nice little chat last time about the cocktail from Sacred Cow. I bet he, if he liked that, he'd really love this one that I brought from Cliff's here today. Well, and this is going to pair with what we've got coming up. See, there he is right there in the doorway, just hanging off the side of the camera, waiting. Uh, this is going to pair great with... The menu portion, which Absolutely, we're going to talk about yeah. here in a little bit. But tell me about what's going to be put together yeah. so here. So this is our Restaurant Week featured cocktail. Restaurant Week runs through uh, Friday this week, uh, through the end of the weekend. And then um, this is going to be called Cheriosity. This is um, our take on a really fun Manhattan. We took the Cedar Ridge Port Cask Bourbon, okay. which is really lovely. You got a bunch of like oaky, chocolatey fruit notes in there. And then we matched that up with a little bit of Carpano Antica. Mm -hmm. Carpano Antica is actually the oldest vermouth in the world. Um, it's a super lovely product. Absolutely full of like those rich botanicals. It's an oxidized fortified wine um, that's made in Italy. And then we actually we matched that up with uh, mom and pop blood orange, which is okay. a bright and fun blood orange vermouth. This is an American company. Not a lot of American companies make vermouth. Uh, so it's super exciting. And this one is actually a woman owned company, which is also really awesome. Uh, we've got a little bit of Aztec chocolate bitters in there as well as some Luxardo cherry syrup. So this is going to be a very decadent, velvety smooth booze forward. And look at this. We, we've got new cherry. technology. We can lift what you're putting together amazing, on here now amazing. too. Amazing, amazing. And oh. also, you know, in bartender technology, I've mixed everything together in advance <laughs> to make so it it's really... So TV ready. Exactly. So it's really easy. We do this for service as well. That way we can get you the drinks as fast as possible. As you're doing this, Jamie, how yeah. do you guys come up with... Do you just... Is it like painting? All right, we're going to put a little bit here, a little bit there and sort of. see what comes up? Or how do you do that? Sort of. I mean, there are basic, like, classic cocktails that w you know work, like an Old Fashioned or a Manhattan or a Margarita. There are certain styles of cocktails that you know are winning recipes and that mm -hmm. people love. And so if you're able to take some of those and able to twist something here or there and add a little fun thing, um, that's an easy way to start off designing your own cocktails. Obviously, as time goes on and you get more comfortable with like cocktail math of like, you know that this much spirit versus this much tart or this much sugar makes something that tastes good, you can get real weird with it. <laughs> uh, but it all just depends and it takes a lot of time to get to know how to do all this stuff. Uh, with something like a stirred cocktail, like a Manhattan or an Old Fashioned or something like that, you actually don't want to shake it because this is going to give us like that velvety smooth texture. Okay. So this is when you want to use the technique of stirring and you actually don't want to disturb that ice at all. You want to create a really soft um, yeah, you're not texture even... that's not aerating. You don't want to add any extra air into the cocktail. Okay. So you want to keep this like super smooth and nice like mouthfeel on there and we're just going to stir it enough to dilute it because we are serving this over ice. So we've got some beautiful large cubes here that we've prepared in advance and you just want that to be as smooth as possible. And this is only for restaurant week, this correct? This is our restaurant week special, okay. yeah. So if you want to try this cocktail, you better get here sooner rather than later. Uh, the nice thing about Cliff's is that it's really close by, so you guys can just walk right down. I walked here this morning. <laughs> we have. <laughs> perfect, perfect. And you're going to garnish this too. Yeah, I mean, part of I've it is just the pretty stuff that goes in it Exactly. Too. I've got a little bit of cherry wrapped around an orange peel for a nice little aromatic kick when you sip the cocktail. And then you get a little snack too. Okay. Yeah. Well. Shall we? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You go right ahead. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> He's here. <laughs> He's here. I'll, I'll make room so we can Enjoy, step in. Guys. I have no microphone on, so I have to talk close to I'll you. I'll stand closer. Cheers. Just, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. Very. I had one little sip. Mmm. I like the, the original, There's the opening a lot note. going on. Yeah. Yes, yeah. That's yeah. Awesome. That port cast. You can really pull that up. Yeah. It's really good. Yeah, it's got a lot of, and the chocolate just is like a little hint at the end mm -hmm. for a little bit of like zhuzh. Um, the blood orange brightens zhuzh. it up a little bit. <laughs> Gotta have talk about zhuzh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this is gonna be our restaurant week feature. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but Cliffs and Moco, um, they're two of the restaurants that we might consider more of like the party places mm -hmm. where people go to like hang out and have a really good time. They also both have cocktail programs that oh. are excellent. You can get a really well done old fashioned margarita, Bloody Mary, any sort of cocktail that you could, like classic cocktail that you could think of as well as their own custom cocktails with cocktail menus, cocktail programs. Uh, the, all of the FNF locations can provide a really nice cocktail experience in addition to just a fun place to party. Well, well and Cliff's is an amazing menu. Yeah. yeah. The food and what itself. Food and drinks, yeah. And the, and the full bar program. Amazing. Yeah, absolutely. I just so. have to stand here and let you two do it. This is the easiest <laughs> show ever.
I'm going to Canada. Yeah. <laughs> there's, a, there's a lot that FNF has to offer, so I think that each place is worth checking out for sure. Let's do this. We're going to put the information up where to find these guys. Go ask for it. Jamie's specialty, Cheriosity, uh, and, and the rest of the crew as well. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you, oh, normal, you know, 11 a.m. to 2 a.m. every day of the week, right? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You guys do bingo over there too? Yeah, bingo on Monday so. nights. Yeah, and actually this cocktail, I'm just representing Weston Burt. He's their bar manager. He mm -hmm. made this. Sorry, Weston. I meant Weston's specialty. Yeah. Prepared by Jamie. Always yeah. good to see you, my friend. Good to see You're you. You're going to stick well. around too. Yeah, absolutely.